guys. Hello, welcome to the vlog today. Um, you might notice that I'm not in my house. Oh my God. We made it to our Airbnb and I didn't vlog at all today. It was hectic packing and then getting everyone here. Um, and we didn't even really do much today. We took the kids to my parents' house and my mom was like, I have it all set up for all the kids to be here overnight. And I was like, that's not possible. And she's like, I promise I have it all set up. I can do it. And I was, hey me. Um, and I was really nervous about it. And she convinced me. So we were with them and then Eric and I went out for like two hours and walked around Santa Barbara and got a coffee and went to Urban Outfitters, which was fun. I went in a store, guys. I'm fancy. And then we went back to my parents' house and we were with the kids and we stayed until they were all asleep. So it's like very late at night. <laughs> I will go straight back in the morning because I'm paranoid, but we're gonna sleep alone tonight without babies. I can't believe it. it doesn't seem real. But I'm gonna show you our little place. It's so cute. Check it out. Hold on, I'll show you. We're watching Love is Blind. So if you hear something, that's what it is. Okay, here's the kitchen, dining room area. And then here's the living area with the TV. I didn't realize how many rooms there was here. Room number one, they all look the same. Bathroom. It's not that exciting. I don't know why I wanted to give you a tour. This is another room that I'm putting all my stuff in. <laughs> so it's my closet. And this is the main room. As you can see, I have Maisie and Wesley's blankie and my pump because my mom had tons of blankets there and so I accidentally left their blankies in the car and I saw them when we were getting all our stuff out of the car and I was like, they're blankies. So I'm gonna sleep with their blankies because I'm that much of a loser or just that much obsessed with my kids. But I am kind of excited to like have a night without them but I don't know what to do. Like I wasn't even gonna vlog anything today at all but then Eric and I were just like pacing around the house. We're like, what do we do? We're all alone. And I was like, I think I need to vlog to feel more normal. So we went to Urban Outfitters and we walked in and we haven't been in a store in such a long time and Eric goes up to me because we were kind of like going to stores every once in a while but then we had the babies and they were in the NICU so we really tried we only went to a couple stores the whole time they were in the NICU and then prepping for Wesley's surgery we didn't go anywhere so I was like oh my god all our kids are healthy we're healthy let's go in a store so we obviously wore masks but we went into Urban Outfitters and we walked in and we were so excited Eric goes okay I'm gonna get you an outfit you get me an outfit I was like okay so he then I asked you and you said you they're crazy say, you have to say it because the clothes there. the clothes there were crazy crazy. What, what like, are the kids wearing? Right like, I, we felt like old people, like yeah. really old people, because we walked in and I was like, wait, what are these clothes? Because there's so many clothes, like oh, flares are back in. Costume shop. Flares are back in, which I wore in high school, except now they're high-waisted flares is what I'm seeing, and I wore very low-waisted flares in high school. But you guys don't understand the horribleness of flares because if it rains, if it snows, if there's any weather where you live, flares, no bueno. Because you walk in a puddle, the bottom of your flares get wet, and it ruins your day because then the bottom of your pants are wet for the rest of the day. Trust me, girls but they're in style, so that's not gonna change anyone's mind. So anyway, there's flares there, there's like crazy. The clothes look crazy. Like we just were like, are we yes. that old? Yeah. We are that old. We don't know what's in style. Well, we're we've like, We've been through a cycle, we've been through a full cycle of fashion. Yeah. Where, you know what I mean? That we've, like, wit we've witnessed it, we've lived it, and now it's right. back to- What we wore when we were in high school. In junior high. High school. Those big jeans, every pair of big jeans, like the back of it would get oh, torn love, don't, up behind your sneaker. Don't, yeah, yes, wet. yes, that's what I'm saying. Like, wet sand. and torn, wet and torn up. Also, don't get those baggy, I don't like those baggy jeans on boys, where like their butts come out. Are you gonna start wearing those to be fashion? Go back to my like belt, but it's also a seat belt <laughs> for a car. With like a chain that attaches your belt loop to your wallet. Ever have a ball chain necklace? No, I wasn't like punk rocker like you. I had a puka <laughs> shell necklace. <laughs> Yeah, we got stuff from Urban Outfitter. I got him an outfit. He got me an outfit. Now you said it had to be the. It was I crazy. You me two. I got you one. I, my first time in the store in months. I went nuts. I got you an outfit. I got me some shirts because I found some shirts that I liked, and I got Corey a shirt, and that's all I got. I hope your outfits you got from me are ugly. You didn't give me a cool outfit. You told me to get a bad one. You said you were getting me an ugly outfit. No, I said I was going. You're gonna create like this is what the kids are wearing. You're gonna look cool. That's not what you said. You said you're getting me something like crazy. I said, are you getting something cool or crazy? And you looked at me like with big eyes, you're like, it's crazy. And I was like, okay, good. And then I got you the craziest things I could find. Okay, this is not going well already. <laughs> Okay, it's right. time to reveal what we bought each other. Eric bought me two outfits, I got him one. So he's gonna give me one that I have to put on. I don't know what it is. And then I'm gonna give him the outfit I bought him and then he's gonna give me the second I outfit. I want to see it laying on the bed. Yeah, we'll see it laying on the bed. He'll reveal and explain why you got the things you got, I guess. Oh my God, what is this? Okay, 
Do you want to explain it? Is there any no, no reason to it? Or are you just like, okay, you know what? This, this goes is over. Fun, this actually. goes over this. I'm not gonna lie, like, I kinda like it. I kinda like this shirt. I kinda like this. Separately, not together. It's got purple. That hat it. is giving me like Lizzie McGuire vibes. Like her best friend named Miranda. That's what that's giving me. Cords, but like baggy. Ugh, I really like corduroy pants and I want a pair of corduroy pants, but not like that. Are these from the men's section? These could not no, be from the girls' are, section. These are from the women's section. Okay, I'm gonna put it on. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I have to show it to Eric. The pants are actually too big. They're massive. The pants are massive. But I I seriously do think like the shirts separately, like I feel like is, I might wear them. The pants are insane. I feel like I'm in like a 90s pop group. Okay, let's show Eric. Let's see what he says. Okay, ready? Okay, open them up. <laughs> you like it? <laughs> you don't like it? Guys! <laughs> I, you know what? What? I don't hate the hat. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's your turn. No, no, come on, come on. Give me a I little fashion like, show. I feel like, honestly, like, these separately would be cute. You're not, what are you oh, doing? Sorry. You're so bad at this, you're filming the frame. I was looking at it, I was caught up in the moment. What am I doing? A fashion like some, show. Yeah. Try what's maybe the what has the the sweater off, right? Like that? Is that yeah. better? That is kind of better. <laughs> I look like a dad going on vacation to Disney World. All right, it's your turn. How do you feel about the pants? They're too big. But you know what I That's feel good. like? I feel like Corky from Waiting for Guffman in the scene where he's dancing and he goes like. <laughs> do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, I do. Okay. You are so bad at filming. Okay, now I'm gonna show you the outfit I got for him. And he's gonna have to wear it. This is very exciting for me because we've never done something like this before. So here's the outfit I got for Eric. Okay, let's just bring him in. Okay, love, come in. <laughs> do you like it? I like it! Oh, wow, and Funky. sunglasses too. <laughs> Okay. Wait, can I tell you why? Okay, so these were just the ugliest pants I could find there. They're just yeah. so ugly. I'm gonna wear them every day now. And Ooh. then this shirt kind of like, it reminds me of like an Uncle Jim shirt from Haters Back Off, <laughs> but also Slash kind of reminded me a little bit of the shirt you wore for your audition for Haters Back Off. Yeah. Just like a funky, fun, like button up. These sunglasses made me excited because they reminded me of sunglasses that Mary-Kate and Ashley wore once yes. when I was very young. Ashley wore the pink ones and Mary-Kate wore the blue ones. And I really wanted the pink ones. They didn't have them in pink, but I saw them and I was like, oh my God, my childhood dreams. I always wanted those sunglasses and I was like, I'm getting them for Eric. Get out of here, I need to get dressed. But wait, I wanna tell you, I actually got you something that I think is kind of cool. And if you don't like it, I want it and I'm probably gonna steal it. So you got something for yourself. I got to, so I saw this material like from afar and I was like, what is that grandma material that looks like it should be a couch at grandma's house? And I got to it and I was like, wait, I love it. It's this hoodie. It's a hoodie with like this weird floral brown Grossness. It kind of looks like vomit from far away. Yeah. But like, I also kind of love it. <laughs> so I got it in a really big size and I was like, I'll give it to him, but if he doesn't want it, I'm gonna you, steal it. So you're, just, you're just telling me that you bought something for yourself. No, do you like it? Am I wrong? That's kind of cool. Oh, no, love, it's terrible. Oh, okay. It's so Doesn't terrible. it look like horrible, like grandma couch? But I feel like I would wear it. Yeah, I feel like I could wear that. It's yeah. kind of fun. Um, He's gonna try that on. He has been in there for so long. It's literally a shirt and pants, and he's been in there for like 10 minutes. You made this, you made this happen. <laughs> oh my goodness, you kinda look cool. Talk to Ron Tuck, he's like. Um, I like, I like Tuck, you look like an 80s. I don't know, I kinda like the shirt and the glasses. Oh. The pants are real bad. Oh, I like the pants. <laughs> What? I'm into the pants. The pants are so ugly. I just, I don't know about the, uh... The shirt, I kind of like. I don't know about my life. And I like the glasses. I'm very jealous of the glasses. You look cool. I like it. That's all I got you. Do you like your outfit? Um, yep. I like the pants. You don't like those pants. Those are so bad, love. So my question to you guys is, is this actually the style now? Like, are these, this is the kind of stuff that's all over Urban you Outfitters. You have another outfit left. Okay, go do it. Go get it, get it, get it. Eric didn't appreciate the glasses, so I've stolen them. And oh, nice. I like it on you. That's I would feel very cool right now. I have a feeling. Okay, I'm gonna go look for. Look, wait, I'm looking at your next outfit. You don't wanna see the reveal? Oh, sure. He's revealing because you got me two cool outfits. Too. I am cool. I think we figured it out, kids. Okay, <laughs> we're gonna go look at the next outfit. Okay. This is fun vibes. 
I'm not, I breast? mean, this is, no bra. yeah, right. Breastfeeding boobies and <laughs> this is very like an Emma Chamberlain. This is like, girls are wearing like stuff like this with no bra these days. This is literally see-through. I actually like this and would wear yeah. it all the time. And I like cords. We'll see if they fit. Okay, I'm gonna try it on. Goodbye. Okay. <laughs> These pants are way too small. <laughs> I think this might be the style that like the like flutter, I call these flutters. What do you guys call them when the pants are like too short? Flutters, but this is like squishing what I got. You're not gonna see this cause it's just nursing bra underneath. So let's see what Eric thinks. What do you think? Yes! <laughs> Cinderella is ready for the fall. This is an idiot. <laughs> Super funk town. You didn't do a fashion show with yours. That's okay. I feel like a major camel toe. That's your thing though, isn't it? Definitely not. It's like... It's not my thing. What do you mean that's your thing? <laughs> Stop! You look this cool. Is... Give me a little... Hey. Oh, I do like that this has a palm tree on the back. Oh, I never even noticed. That's awesome. Isn't that sweet? That's a really cool sweater. Look at how tight these are. That they're going too small. And they're going up my anus. Oh, it's a camera. <laughs> you are uh, a mess. <laughs> that's a really cool sweater. Here are our outfits. So that's the video for today because I didn't vlog anything today. Um, that's what you get. I hope you enjoyed our fashion show. Oh, I gotta say goodbye to them. Uh, we have, we'll say goodbye with our walk together. Okay, Eric wants to end this video with Stop a walk. Stop going to help me every time. <laughs> with a walk together. Like a Bruno, he told me the, the do you know what that is? No, I don't know. I saw it in the back. That is, oh, you're trying to do cool. I was later trying to do, okay, then start over, start over. Okay, go. Oh, we're being cool. Do we look like your parents? <laughs> you can relax. Colleen and Eric have a podcast. The world is scary and we're locked in our home. But now we have big microphones. So you can relax. That's the name of our podcast.